This case consider the issue of the intention to enter into a contract for the sale of land, and whether or not a signed letter amounted to a legally enforceable contract for the sale of land. In this case, a prospective purchaser and vendor of a property entered into negotiations for the sale of a property and signed a letter outlining some of the essential terms of the sale, including the purchase price and the date for exchange. They then instructed their solicitors to draw up the contract, but did not provide the letter to their solicitors. Complications arose and the vendor decided not to sell the property.